Members of the Benin Solidarity Movement in a protest march through Sapler Road to Nigeria Petroleum Development Company in Benin City. The protest created traffic gridlock on Sapler Road as one lane was blocked by the protesters who said they are out to register their displeasure over what they call marginalization of the Benins by oil producing companies operating in the state. They demanded to know the number of Benin indigents employed by oil companies in the state, how much of the corporate social responsibilities the oil companies have carried out modalities put in place by oil companies to address the level of environmental degradation being experienced by their host communities, amongst others. We cannot have a big company like, like NPDC, a capitalist one par excellence, and yet our youths have no job. It's just as if we are living very close to the river. We are using saliva to wash our hands. It is an aberration. Majority of the offices are dominated by no indigenous to the detriment of local content. For a very long time, the Benin have been marginalized. There is no employment for the Benin youth. If they know, don't do business here. The Benins must be fully engaged in employment. After several hours of agitation, leaders of the protesting members of the Benin Solidarity Movement held a closed-door meeting with the management of NPDC. Representatives of the protesters comment on the outcome of the meeting with management of NPDC. We have met with uh, the management and we have showed them our demand and they are ready to comply with our demands. They have given us their word that by two weeks time, they will, talk, they will give us all details of what we required. And we are going to make a, a tour around all their social, uh, corporate social responsibilities they've done. The number of uh, our people they've given scholarship to and given bursary to, we told them that we want to get the list of them. Efforts to get comments of the management of the NPDC on the issue was unsuccessful as a staff who declined interviews said they have not been mandated from the headquarters to speak. I bo J. Reporting.